Have you ever wondered if your personal information is lurking on the dark web? In today's video, we're about to reveal the eye-opening reality of your online data and its potential presence on the dark web. During the first quarter of 2023, more than 6 million data records were exposed worldwide. But what exactly is the dark web and why should you be concerned about it? The dark web may be compared to the internet's secret underworld because it isn't indexed by popular search engines like Google. It can only be accessed using specialized programs like Tor and is purposely hidden from interested members of the general public. The dark web, which is famous for its privacy, typically generates ideas of illegal acts. However, it's more than simply an escape for the unwanted. It's also a market for secrets. Now you may be questioning what can you find on the dark web then? The range of choices is wide. It's an enormous digital market with anything from hacking services to digital media like movies and games. But in this video, I'll be talking about stolen data. When a data breach happens, your personal information, credit card details, and login credentials are frequently up for sale. Now let's delve into how you can check if your personal information has made its way onto the dark web. I'll make it easy for you with a simple Google search. Open your preferred web browser and go to Google One. Ensure you're on the home tab. Look for the dark web report and click try now. Once you click try now, you want to initiate the scan by clicking run scan. The scan will start examining various websites where you may enter your emails and passwords and high risk websites where your data could be compromised. This process typically takes around 5 to 10 seconds. As you can see, I performed the scan and fortunately my personal information isn't lurking on the dark web. However, I asked my friends to do the same and the results, much to his shock, were concerning. His whole name, usernames, passwords, and email had all been exposed. Even more unbelievable is the fact that his data unknowingly been obtainable on websites created for learning and artistic activities. This serves as a warning that seems like innocent websites might be the source of your data's exposure on the dark web. It might be upsetting to learn that your personal data is out there on the dark web, but there is no guaranteed method to get it off of this hidden platform. However, if you know which information has been revealed, you may take proactive steps to protect yourself against identity theft and online hackers. Here are three ways you can try to protect yourself. Make sure you create strong, unique passwords for every online account. If one account does get hacked, this could stop hackers from accessing several accounts. Another way is enabling 2FA whenever possible. It adds an extra layer of security by requiring you to verify your identity through a secondary method, such as a text, message, or app notification. The last method is to make it a habit to regularly check your emails, bank statements, and credit card transactions for any signs of suspicious activity. Try to report any unauthorized transactions or unexpected account access to the relevant authorities or institutions. I hope you learned a thing or two from this video and make sure to strengthen your online defenses because in the world of the internet, it's better to stay safe than sorry. If you're facing any problems that you need fixed, let me know in the comments below and I'll reply as soon as possible. But if you guys enjoyed this type of content, make sure to like and subscribe.